Good afternoon, everybody. I want to uh, welcome you all to City Hall here at Brockton, Massachusetts, the City of Champions. Today is a special day. Um, again, Hispanic Heritage Month started uh, yesterday on the 15th, and it continues for a month. Uh, today, I want to welcome each and every one of you as we uh, proudly celebrate the 212th uh, anniversary of Mexico's Independence Day from Spain. Again, on uh, yeah, give it a round of applause. Thank you. Thank you. I want to, uh, as always, thank the elected officials. I know Ward 7 School Committee member Tim Sullivan is here. Tim never misses a flag raising. Thank you for being here. The Vice Chair of School Committee from Ward 6, Joyce, uh, Joyce Azak, is here. Thank you, Vice Chairman. I see Shirley Azak, City Councilor from Ward 7, former President of the City Council. Thank you for being here. I know Plymouth County District Attorney Tim Cruz will be joining us today. And, Inez Figueroa from the Latin Women's Association. Thank you, Inez, for always being here. So uh, again, as I said, today in the city of Brock that we proudly celebrate uh, Mexicans in Mexico's Independence Day. On September 16th in the year 1810, Miguel Hidalgo y Costella uh, called on the town of Dolores to take up arms against New Spain. Every year, Mexico's Independence Day has become a prominent national celebration. Mexico celebrates with street parties, fiestas, parades, food, beverages, and endless, endless fireworks. Mexican Independence Day is celebrated on sep September 16th by the people of Mexican ancestry worldwide, and we proudly do so today in the city of Brockton. Today, we celebrate Independence Day by raising, in just a few moments, the Mexican uh, flag to showcase the wonderful Mexican community members and business owners here in the city of Brockton. I want to thank uh, Yalapa Mexican Grill for providing such wonderful, generous food that we will have at the end. If you haven't tried out Yalapa, please do. It's a fantastic, fantastic uh, representation of wonderful food. Uh, I also want to thank, again, everybody for being here, all the elected officials, all the city employees, all the school employees that have joined us. I also want to thank the custodians and those that work for the building department that always set up when we do this. As I said yesterday for El Salvadorian Independence Day, Brockton has always been made up of wonderful diversity. It's what makes Brockton Brockton, right? And to be able to showcase all the diversity in the city of Brockton is what I'll continue to do as long as I'm mayor of this great city. So at this time, I am going to ask um, Monica Rinald to please come to the podium. I have a proclamation. Yeah, all right, woo! How are you? Great to see you. Thank you for being here. Proclamation for the city of Brockton. Whereas on September 16th, 1810, Mexico declared independence from Spain. Whereas today, September 16th in the year 2022, Mexican Independence Day recognizes the 212th anniversary of the independence of Mexico. And whereas our vibrant Mexican community has made tremendous, tremendous contributions here to the city of Brockton, the city of champions. Whereas it is appropriate that Brockton residents throughout our great city join with our Mexican American community around the Commonwealth, the county, and the city, and the nation to highlight the friendship shared by the two countries, the United States and Mexico, and to honor and respect the liberty that the Mexican people fought for and have protected since 1810. Now there, there I for Robert F. Sullivan as mayor of the city of Brockton do hereby proclaim proudly Today, the 16th day of September in the year 2022 in Brockton as Mexican Independence Day. And I ask respectfully and urge all residents and business owners to please join me today in observing this proud day. And I want to give Monica this proclamation. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, all right. Thank you, thank you, Monica. I want to thank uh, all the youngsters that are here as well. I want to thank you for wearing a wonderful, wonderful appropriate ethic care. I want to recognize uh, City Council President Jack Lally for being here. Uh, at this time, I'm going to ask uh, anybody and everybody, and specifically Monica and the Latin Women's Association as well, to join us as we proudly hoist the Mexican, Mexican flag here in the city of Brockton.
Again, I want, to, uh, I want to thank each and every one of you for being here today. I want to thank uh, Ed Miller, who is here on behalf of Senator Mike Brady. Thank you for being here. Again, we, uh, we are going to continue to celebrate uh, all the communities that make up the City of Champions. Again, Yalapa Mexican Grill has wonderful, wonderful food here. Uh, so again, Viva Mexico, Viva La Ciudad de Brockton. Have a great day, everybody. Be well, stay safe. God bless you all.